It's a battle of light versus dark at the Twilight Breaking Dawn Part 2 premiere. Which looks did you like the best? Hey guys, happy day after the last Twilight flick premiere. You're back at Clever News. Thanks for tuning in for all your Breaking Dawn Part 2 coverage. Last night at the premiere, so many of our favorite ladies walked the black carpet, looking hotter than ever, coincidentally all wearing black. Ashley Tisdale matched the dark vampire theme of the evening, showing off her stems in a long sleeve black mini. The Free People Aja Evangeline dress had hints of gold shimmer, which we think looked pretty pretty awesome up against her shiny blonde locks. Ash polished off the look with black accessories, a simple black clutch, and black high heel booties. Julianne Huff opted for a more bold and edgy look than we're used to seeing on her. She picked a Kaufman Franco top and skirt that had chunky jewel detailing, sheer cutouts around the torso and back, and a cinched waistband to accent her tiny waist. She matched the rocker chic dress with some rocker chic hair, fastening it all up almost almost like a sexy mohawk. Aussie cutie Teresa Palmer was also on hand at the premiere, showing off some major skin. She bared her toned tummy and most of her chest and shoulders in a sheer beaded Emilio Pucci cocktail dress. We're loving that she kept her hair simple in a ponytail so we could keep our focus on the daring dress. But in stark contrast, the leading ladies of the night opted for jewel tones. Rosalie Cullen herself, Miss Nikki Reed, chose a simple silhouette shaped Versace gown with incredible chain detailing along the bust and sides. Alice Cullen, the lovely Ashley Green, opted for a custom blush colored gown by Donna Karen. It was super feminine and we especially loved the one shoulder look on her toned arms. But last but certainly not least, the queen of the evening, Kristen Stewart, was a golden goddess in her Zuhair Maraud dress. It cinched her perfectly at the waist and featured a sheer lace peekaboo slit along the torso so legs and backside. Definitely a stellar dress to wear to her last and final premiere as Bella Swan. Okay guys, it's time to vote. Are you into the black dresses we saw on Ashley Tisdale, Julianne Huff, and Teresa Palmer? Or do you prefer the softer colors that Nikki Reed, Ashley Green, and Kristen Stewart wore? Vote dark versus light and tell me which gal is your pick for best dressed of the evening. Also, make sure you're plugged into Clever News by subscribing to our channel for more scoop on the final Twilight premiere and of course, all the best in Hollywood. At the studio, I'm your host, Deidre Behar. Thanks for stopping by and have a great Tuesday.